Do you have a Velcro cat? If your cat sticks to you like Velcro, you've probably got a clingy cat on your hands. Whether or not this is a good thing depends on a few factors, including your perspective and the reasons your cat is clingy. To some cat parents, any cat that exhibits more dog-like behaviors, such as following you around the house, running to greet you when you come home, or being extra affectionate, is considered clingy when compared to cats who are more independent and aloof. But some cats can be clingy to an unhealthy degree. How can you tell the difference? Signs of clinginess in cats. Following you everywhere, including to the bathroom. Want to constantly be on you when you're sitting or lying down. Meowing constantly to get your attention. Demanding affection when you're trying to focus on something other than them. Refusing to eat when you're not there. Acting shy and sticking close to you when visitors come over. Sulking or hiding when you're getting ready to leave, or rubbing against your legs in an attempt to keep you there. Get overly excited when you return home. Eliminating outside the litter box and other destructive behavior. Why are some cats clingy? Some cats are simply clingy by nature, with some purebred cat breeds like the Siamese and the Abyssinian known for their clingy personalities. But in some cases, clinginess can be a sign that something is up with your kitty, therefore, it's important to pay attention to what might be causing this behavior. One or more of the following causes might be behind your kitty's clinginess. Boredom. Your cat might be clingy simply because they aren't getting enough mental and physical stimulation, says Pet Bucket. Taking breaks to play with your cat and providing interactive toys to help keep them active and entertained throughout the day can help in these cases. Premature weaning and separation. Kittens can develop separation anxiety from being weaned too early or from being taken from their mothers and littermates before they're ready, says Catspro. Calm. Kittens typically move from mother's milk to solid food around 8 weeks of age. But adopting them as soon as they're weaned can prevent them from learning important social skills from their mother and siblings that can set them up to be more secure and independent as adults. Insecurity. Cats are routine-oriented, and any change in their routines or environment can make them feel insecure and send them looking to you for reassurance. Big changes like moving to a new home, the addition or loss of another pet or family member, or kids going back to school after a long vacation can be enough to make your kitty need the reassurance of constant contact. Newly rescued cats may also need a lot of reassurance that they're wanted and welcome in their new home, wanting to provide comfort. Cats are highly sensitive to human moods and emotions. It could be that your kitty senses that you're going through a difficult time and wants to be there to comfort you and make sure you're okay. Pregnant pet parent. Some cats have an uncanny ability to sense when a woman is pregnant and become extremely affectionate throughout the pregnancy, says Catsbro. Calm. Exactly how a cat can tell there's a baby on the way is a mystery, but if you're expecting, don't be surprised if your kitty wants to snuggle up to your baby bump. Lack of enforced boundaries. Some clingy kitties are simply spoiled. If you pamper your kitty by giving in to all of their demands, you'll reinforce their clingy, demanding behavior by teaching them they can easily manipulate you to get what they want, says all about cats. Underlying health issues. Young women bonding with calico cat bumping rubbing bunting head dementia in elderly cats and can also indicate other health problems. A neurological condition known as cerebellar hypoplasia CH, tends to make cats exceptionally cuddly and attention-seeking, and it's usually accompanied by balance issues and lack of coordination. While it can be nice to have a highly affectionate pet, some cat parents find that overly clingy and demanding behavior is disruptive. If this is the case, you'll need to take steps to help your kitty be less clingy and more independent. And if your formerly aloof cat has suddenly begun displaying signs of clinginess, pay attention to other signs that could indicate health problems. In general, any time your cat has a sudden change in behavior, it's a good idea to consult your veterinarian. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. How to help an overly clingy cat Identify the cause. While it might be obvious, you may need to do some detective work. Keep in mind that cats are so sensitive to change that something as seemingly minor as getting a new sofa or rearranging the furniture can cause your kitty distress. Consult your vet. If you suspect health issues might be involved, schedule a checkup with your vet. They can also help determine whether separation anxiety resulting from premature weaning is the cause and advise you on how to treat it. Set firm boundaries and enforce them. Close the bathroom door behind you, don't give in to every demand for attention and make your lap available on your terms, not your kitties. Schedule playtime. Provide toys to relieve boredom when you're busy or away from home. 
place a perch next to a busy window for birds and people watching. If this isn't possible, search online for videos for cats, which can help keep your cat entertained while you get other things done. Consider adopting another cat. While some cats thrive on being only pets, clingy cats can benefit from having another kitty around to keep them company. This is especially true for cats who become clingy after the loss of another household pet. Discipline. Now, this last one isn't for everyone but I personally used these techniques and found they actually worked really well. When your cat is behaving badly in an effort to get your attention, doing extreme things like clawing walls, the following disciplinary measures can be effective. With consistency, your cat will learn not to continue the bad behavior. Compressed air or another loud alternative, can help deter your cat from repeating the bad behavior. Cats don't like loud noise, especially the unfamiliar, and will stop what they're doing. They will eventually associate the bad behavior with the disliked sound and avoid it altogether. Water in a spray bottle, if your cat doesn't like water. Using a loud tone of voice. I have a tone when I tell my cat to stop doing what he's doing. Somehow, he understands it and usually quits his bad behavior. But cats are notorious for not doing as told so this one may not work for everyone, but it's worth a shot. Adopting a potentially clingy cat. If you're thinking about adopting a cat, take your time choosing the right one. Carefully research any breeds you're considering so you'll know what to expect. Consider whether you have the time and energy for a highly affectionate, potentially clingy cat. If adopting from a shelter, pay multiple visits to the cat you're considering to see how they behave around you as they become more familiar with you. Cats can take a while to let their true personalities shine, so the more you can get to know a cat before bringing them home, the better. And if adopting a kitten, urge the shelter staff to keep the litter with their mother until three months of age to give them time to be fully weaned and socialized by their original cat family. It's nice when your kitty is affectionate and wants to be with you, but too much of a good thing can be a problem. Taking steps to help your kitty be less clingy can help both of you be happier, and may even help your kitty be healthier in the process. Whether you're raising a kitten or nurturing an adult cat, most strategies will work as long as you do them with genuine love and concern. Keep in mind that owning a cat is a big responsibility and not just a hobby that you can set aside once you've grown tired of it. Patiently caring for your cat and employing the above methods will help you bring out the best in your cat. A happy and healthy cat will be much easier to care for, making it a wonderful addition to your home. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.